uh, we're going to do a very, very interesting comparison today. Uh, before we start, we're going to do a quick introduction and then we'll just jump into it. Okay, yeah, so my, my name is Ruben. Uh, I'm a PhD student here in uh, Winnipeg, uh, Canada, and uh, I speak uh, Tamil, Malay, and English. Uh, hi, my name is Neha. So I am basically from Bangalore, South India, and my mother tongue is Canada. All right, perfect. So I'm just going to say something about the format of this video. Uh, the way we have this structured is for the first part, uh, there, there are going to be two sentences each, and these sentences uh, are structured so that uh, they use certain words that are in common between the two languages. So for the people who are watching, if you find these sentences to be odd or strange, keep that in mind <laughs> because uh, they were put together so that uh, they use words that share the same root. Um, and then after we do that, it's going to be a little bit easier, the first part, uh, to get yourself, to get you guys started. And then uh, we're going to do paragraphs, which will be a little bit more challenging. Okay. So I'm going to start my first sentence. Sure. Okay, so this is the easy one. Um, what an eye in kaiye karittadu. Okay, yeah, this, I think I understand it. It says maybe one dog bit my hand. Yeah, a dog or bit my hand. Dog will bite, or like, what is it? Is a dog bit my hand? A dog my... bit its past tense. Okay, yeah, so a dog yeah. bit my hand. <laughs> Just a... Yeah, because... <laughs> Uh, varu is vandu in Kannada and then nai is nai, like a dog. Yeah, so so the, the, the words I got was nai, so that should be in Kannada. And then I got the word kai. Yeah, hand. Hand, yeah. So I said kai, so like my hand. Like, oh, so, okay. Or like the hand. Okay. So it bit the hand, yeah. Yeah, you, you got it. So yeah, I think mine is pretty similar as well, the first one. It is aru gante mele kalu navu shuru agutte. <laughs> um, uh, maybe if, I, if you want me to okay. rephrase it, it will be yes. R gante mele kal navu shuru agutte. Does R okay? Aru means six. Gante does that mean clock or bell? Pretty close. So R gante mele. So mele means up. Is it like at six o'clock? Yeah. R gante mele. Okay, what was the what was kal navu shuru agutte? Kal. Does kal mean like one quarter? No. Oh, time. No. Okay, I am. Yeah, it does quite mean that <laughs> too, but in this sentence, it's a different one. So it does uh, mean ar gante mele kal navu shuru agutte. At six. Okay, I'm gonna ignore kal. What is okay navu kal kal? Is it leg? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. So in Tamil, that's just Kal. Okay, interesting. Okay, okay. Kal. Ar gante mele. At six o'clock, my leg. My leg. So it says, after six o'clock, leg. Novu. Shuru agutte. Shuru is, again, you know, start start i will start to walk no. no oh like your legs would hurt yeah so novu means hurt pain pain yeah. okay so i guess at six no i, I guess after six o'clock uh after six o'clock my can you say, say something aru gante mele mm -hmm. kalu novu shuru agutte after six o'clock, my legs, I guess, would start to hurt. Yeah. Shuru. Yeah. So start is shuru. Oh, okay. So novu is basically pain. So it, the, the whole sentence means after six o'clock, my legs start to hurt or my legs start paining. Okay. So I got yes. the word six and okay. leg. Yes. So six is aru, leg yeah. is kalu. Okay. So my sense is nale, malay. Tutoralamena, say the alert chonar. Repeat it again, please. Okay. Nale. So, yeah, Nale, Marai, Turalamena, say the alert chonar. So, Nale is tomorrow. Yes. Male is rain. Yes. The other one, the last one, Cholaru, is half told? Yeah, okay. So, sonar, 
means he told or he, so not just means like it's a respectful way of saying they, they told. told yeah so it's non-gender so let me guess it's tomorrow rain the what, what's the the can, okay can you repeat okay. that nale marai thooralamena seidiyalar chonnar it's actually seidiyalar sonnar when you join it becomes seidiyalar chonnar seidiyalar meaning do you know what seidi means are they experts huh? experts no so seidi ah no they, they no they they're not experts they just let's say if you turn on the tv and you want to know what's happening you watch seidi the news yes okay so that is a forecast that it will rain tomorrow that's the meaning of the sentence yeah you got it but say the so say the and aler what is what is aler the news teller yes so i was going to say newscaster so say the aler means the news person oh so say the aler oh, okay. uh, i guess what is it yeah so malay to tural means rain rain ana means like it might it will rain so tural amena then say the aler chonnar so uh, it it basically means that it uh, okay the news caster just told that it would rain tomorrow yes that's it oh yeah say the alert so uh, way better than me <laughs> i mean i didn't know say the alert say say the alert means a new news caster yeah cuz say the means news alert just means person the so person who tells anything with alert is like something person oh okay so yeah. wait so when you said male thurala mm. so male means rain thural means like rain ana is like it will it will so thurala mena means it it will might. rain yeah so basically what i wrote was tomorrow rain will rain newscaster said oh, okay it's a, it's a bit uh, it's yeah. a bit twist my sentence is munjaneya kanasu nija agutte annodu janara nambike Oh, okay. You can go word by word. Munjaneya mm-hmm. kanasu. Does munjaneya mean like like mundaya like yesterday or previous? No. No. Okay. Okay. Let me let me again. Yeah. Munjaneya kanasu nija agutte annu vudu janara nambike. Nijam means true. So kanav means dream. kanavu nijam okay so dream real thing um did you say nambike yeah so nambike means belief yes i think i'm just going to say that i i believe like my dream would come true <laughs> uh you're pretty close okay i'll try to guess the words yeah so munjaneya kanasu kanasu nija agutte annuvudu janara nambike janara this munjane have anything to do time yes so it's not previous like time, yesterday no, it's not, before it's, it's the it's in a day okay so like is it like like last night mm, no it's like it's a time in the day oh okay so moon doesn't mean before no okay so moon first means before so Uh, like for us yeah munde mm-hmm. means afterwards like it before uh, but yeah, this is yeah. munjane this like a whole sentence so that you can't break it down okay so if you if you were to break it down what is it mun you, and, you, you cannot, oh you cannot, you cannot do it because this uh, this actually is the whole word okay. so this is not like a sandhi or something giving also what comes is it before m- afternoon it's like morning yeah oh okay so that's very different first it's kale Okay. Kale means morning uh-huh. and male means evening. Evening. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's so okay. Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. No, that's the so different. Um so you said in the morning. Okay, can you say the sentence again? Munjaneya kanasu nija agutte annodu janara nambike. Is it like in the morning um you hope that your dream will come to later? like in the day yeah so it's ba- it basically means that the morning dreams will come true it's the belief of the people 
So the, you know okay. they say that you know huh. when you dream at like four a.m. or five a.m. your dreams might come true. So that is how it is. So that is like that. That's a belief of the people, right? Interesting. Okay. Yeah. yeah no, I didn't know that. Yeah. Okay. Just want to say one thing that no one talks like this in real life because this is like standard Tamil. Okay. So it's like you what you read in the books, what you read in uh, what you hear in the news. So it is going to sound weird. Yeah, it's going to be difficult <laughs> for me. Yeah. Yeah, but, but this is like proper standard it. Tamil. Okay. காட்டில் ஓர் அழகிய ஏரி இருந்தது அந்த ஏரியில் ஓர் ஆமைத் தனது இரு வாத்து நண்பர்களுடன் வாழ்ந்து வந்தது அன்றாடம் அந்த இரு வாத்துகளை ஆமை சந்திப்பது வழக்கம் can you repeat that again please <laughs> that's okay. okay so i'll just read the first sentence kaatil or alagiya eri irundadu oru is one yes uh, yeah so i said or yeah but it's also, it like, also means is one it yeah once? yeah uh, it, it just means it means an okay like so, one yeah. okay kaatil mm. uh, kaatil forest yes kaatil because we in, say kaadu Yes. Yeah, so we can, we in, in Canada we say kaadu so yes. kaatile is might be forest. Exactly. So one forest. Oh, she's going to say in Tamil it's also kaadu. Okay. But if you add kaadu plus il, il means in, okay. it becomes kaatil grammatically. Oh. So it is kaadu. So basically this means like the two words in a forest. Yes. Okay. Cuz it that one word means in the forest okay, like it's okay, like three okay. in one. Yeah. 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 Uh, kaatil or alagiya So, I like here. I like here meaning. Okay. Is, is it an animal? Or, so, I'm, I'm just putting a thing here because yeah. it's a forest and the animals. No, it's... Uh, this first sentence doesn't have animals. Okay. Okay. So, I like here. I like here. Eri irundadu. You know what irundadu means? Irundadu is, is there. Yes. Okay. So, kaatil or... So, in so, the jungle... Maybe in uh, the jungle, there is a house? No. Hut? No. no think something a big tree natural uh, yeah, yeah um so airy you know what airy is bridge no but kind of close airy yes airy so there is there is a dash in the forest yes um this adjective and dash in the forest so alagia is the adjective alagia is beautiful yes so yes so in the jungle there's a beautiful river close very close stream You're is getting... it a water body yes <laughs> yes lake pond yeah. yes lake lake i was okay. going to say canada is known for airy okay. yeah, yeah. yeah. so lakes lake. so, so there is a beautiful lake in the forest yes okay yes so kaatil or alagiya airy irundadu okay next sense and the airil or aame tanadu இரு வாத்து நண்பர்களுடன் வாழ்ந்து வந்தது Yeah, no, so I, I wanted to, I purposely brought this sense up because of the L's that we have. Yeah. So if we've got three L's, right? So this La, La and Ra. Yeah. So it's three L's. Yeah. So this sense uses like all the three L's. Wow. <laughs> so okay, that's wait. why. I got the first part, okay? Because I got the first, like the first sentence. Yes. Like, there is a... There's a beautiful lake in the forest. Yes. Near the lake, there is a tortoise. Ah, uh, under means that. Okay, that. Lake so under a... aerial, that aerial, or ame. Yeah, exactly. It means tortoise. tortoise. Yeah, so ame is tortoise in Canada as well. Perfect. Yeah. yeah. So ame, tanadu. Do you know tanadu? No. Like. Uh, babies. No, no, no. It's it's like a. a Lives. No, I don't know how you'd say. It's like a first person thing to say. Like, uh, well, I guess third person thing to say. Like me? Uh, but I'm talking about... The, oh, uh, his! Yeah, but in this case, it's... Uh, so it's its. Okay, its. Okay. So we don't use gender for, for animals. Oh, okay. So we don't use he or she. We use it for animals. So mm-hmm. this is it. So um, at that lake, the... Um, so it's, like, like, yeah, so... It used to live? No, so and uh, like, like a tortoise. Um, so it. So um, it's... I'm going to say, Iru vatu nanbar galudan vandu vandadu. Iru. Stays? No. Oh, no, no, no. So, Iru, yes, stay, but in this case, it's different. Iru. Iru is stop? That's also right, but not here. 
another another iru iru is a conjugation so there's a real iru, word it's longer iru. do you also mean irul like night no 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 okay uh, read the whole thingy in tamil yeah, yeah. so and the eril or ame tanadu iru vaatu nanbargaludan nanbargaludan is one word vaandu vandadu vaand vandadu is come or came is close i'm just going to tell you this one so vandadu just means that is happening sort of but we as one do does mean come but in this case it means that it is doing it or it's it, it's it's just doing its thing <laughs> like like it's happening one do in this case means oh, it's, it's hap- happening yeah yeah is. so the first sentence is there is a beautiful lake in the forest in that lake there is a tortoise yes and it is happening something like it yes. is there is something happening in the lake with the tortoise so it as in belonging like it's it does something it's with, house um no it does something so with it does something with its iru nanbargal shell no no okay so i'll, I'll just translate the vaandu uh, for you mm. so valke means life vaandu means valke means so, life vaandu so, means live yes lives lives so present tense so i'm saying at that lake so there's a tortoise a tortoise li- uh, a tortoise that is living there okay okay now it does something தனது இரு நண்பர்களுடன் வாழ்ந்து வந்தது i'm not sure how you say it, like a nominal value or something mm-hmm. yeah so woru something a uh, and then two like iru so, so it means two so, so with his two friends so okay so in a beautiful lake that lived a tortoise with his two friends that's it okay that's all this oh that's the whole that's the sentence oh i'm done with the paragraph no 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 you've got one more to go <laughs> okay so now la- so there, there there was a beautiful lake um at that lake a tortoise lived with its two uh, friends yes. oh, okay i forgot one more word actually iru vaatu nanbargaludan so vaatu what's vaatu nam stays no so it's a type of animal what? so it's two animal friends but what animal is it vaatu is it uh... it lives in the lake like sort of and it lives on land as well frog no like is it a bird yes it's a duck okay so with his two duck friends oh, okay. because it's from a it's from a kid story ah. so i'm saying uh or ame tanadi iru vaatugal so two vaatu friends like two duck two friends two duck friends yeah so okay. iru vaatu nanbargaludan okay. then vaandu vandadu yeah in this case was living yeah okay, okay last sentence andraadam and iru vaatugalai ame sandippadu valakkam I got to know ame I got to know duck So repeat repeat the sentence again please Andradam all of them No that is like ella ella means all uh, of them uh-huh. right so this and andra andradam and the iru vaatugale ame sandippadu valakkam So valakkam means the norm The norm Yes So now So wait okay if if you say the norm if i am guessing it it should be uh, tortoise being friends with those ducks wasn't normal No 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 no, no, no. you can have friends with whoever you want <laughs> That's fine uh no so okay what's andradam that's the first word andradam all all of them No they both they all no, three no. of them Andradam is something to do with time Evening No sort of like So once today. upon a time no so you have today uh-huh. which is indru mm-hmm. then you have tomorrow naale day of day before you, day after tomorrow oh sorry sorry naale mm. so today is ivattu yes no but andradam means that it's day. occurring cool. it's occurring all the time like you go to school andradam every day yes okay andradam means every day okay so andradam every day like i pause andradam and 
అందస్ ఆల్ ఆఫ్ దెమ్ ఆ దట్ ఓకే దట్ యా ఐ గెస్ దోస్ యా అండ్ ఇరు వాతుగలై so so you, those two ducks yeah those two lay means those okay iru vaatugalai aame tortoise okay sandippadu sandippu that's the word talk no but to talk what you have to do you have to go and greet meet meet okay yeah that's the one so sandippadu valakkam every day the uh, every day those two ducks would come to meet the tortoise Or so it's right but it's just the opposite so what i said was um every day um the tortoise goes to meet uh them. yeah and and meets the the two ducks and that's the norm so uh in another way of saying is um normally the the tortoise would meet the two ducks every day oh okay yeah so that's it so my paragraph is one urali ఒబ్బ రాజ ఇద్ద అవన అరమనేయల్లి తుంబ సిరి ఇత్తు ఇస్ దట్ యు హోల్ బ్యాక్ అప్ నో ఐ ఓ యు వాంట్ టు రీడ్ ద హోల్ పారాగ్రాఫ్ ఫస్ట్ ఇస్ ద వన్ సెంటెన్స్ యస్ ఓకే దట్ సో లాంగ్ ఓకే యా సో వన్ ఊరల్లి ఒబ్బ రాజ ఇద్ద అవన అరమనేయల్లి తుంబ సిరి ఇత్తు అవనిగె అదన్న హెంగె అవని అవనిగె అదన్న హేగె బలసలు గొత్తిరలల్ల ಅದರಿಂದ ಜನರಿಗೆ ತುಂಬ ಕಷ್ಟವಾಗುತ್ತಿತ್ತು ಮಂತ್ರಿಗಳ ಸಹಾಯದಿಂದ ರಾಜ ಆ ಸಿರಿಯನ್ನು ಸೆರೆಯಾಗಿ ಬೆಳೆಸಿ ಪ್ರಜೆಗಳ ಕಷ್ಟ ದೂರ ಮಾಡಿದ ಸೋ ದಟ್ಸ್ ಮೈ ಹೋಲ್ ಪ್ಯಾರಾಗ್ರಾಫ್ ಸಿ ಐ ರೆಕಗ್ನೈಸ್ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಬಟ್ ದೇ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಸೋ ರೆಪಿಟೇಟಿವ್ ದೇ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೋ ಲೈಕ್ ಐ ನೋ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಬಟ್ ದೇ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಜೆಲ್ ಆಮ್ ಓಕೆ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಅ ಕಿಂಗ್ ಅರಮ್ ಅರಮ್ ಪುರು ಸೋ ಅರಮ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಗುಡ್ Oh, is it bad? No. No, okay, wait. I don't know. Uh, and then you said something about he does something to his ministers and puts them in jail. <laughs> no. <laughs> you said Siri. Siri means jail. Siri. Oh, Siri. It's small? No. Okay, never mind. Okay, I'm going to start from... Let me read the first sentence, mm. okay? One door alli, obba raja idda. Avana aramane alli, tumba Siri ittu. No, uh, read it before Avana. Just the... half the first sentence one urali obba raja idda one are you saying like in in a in a ur like in a village or town or something so sort of like so in tamil will be like oru urile like in one ur okay uh there was a king hmm. right is hmm. that all hmm. okay cool raja avana king avana aramane alli tumba siri ittu oh aramane is that palace yeah aha aranmane yeah. that's okay um he had a really big palace no but close he had a can you say that again avana aramaneyalli tumba does avana mean his yeah okay okay aramaneyalli tumba siri ittu tumba means a lot like yes romba let me yes. say romba yeah. okay yeah. so tumba uh siri Oh, very it's not very small is it no, no it's not very small tumba is as you said very too like much. is it like very grand or no but know. pretty close though hmm tumba let's let's come back to that we read the next sentence okay yeah avanige adna hege balasalu gottiralilla avan him him avanige like for him with him mm, no hmm can you read the sentence again the second one avanike adna okay avanukku for him yeah okay yeah yeah avanukku avanike okay yeah adna hege balasalu gottiralilla this balasalu mean something to its strength no that is bhala bhala that is bha okay bha. With, yeah okay, this that. is bha like, oh, okay bala okay. bala salu balasalu yeah like it's a, it's a la and a la like bala yeah yeah balasalu salu uh um uh, balam so adna adna is uh that 
like mm. if you if you have got the first sentence you would make like you know the third sentence would have yeah. the second sentence would have actually made it yeah your, I, i didn't know what tumba meant tumba you said it yeah was, oh, sorry the other word after tumba siri yeah siri i don't very uh, so mm. it fun he said the king uh, can you read the first sentence again maybe one durali obba raja itta okay no in in one in one uru there was a king avana aramaneyalli tumba siri ittu um he had a very big castle i would keep thinking no big. so aramane is a is a palace. palace yeah inside palace what does every king have like, like a, a lot of oh like gold clothes yeah money yeah like wealth oh siri means wealth yeah Oh, wow. Siri is Siri is 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 wealth, but wealth. not in the talking terms. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Like like do you mention like this mm-hmm. is not like the proper yeah. So yeah. I mean Siri is not actually used in an everyday mm-hmm. language, but when you are telling your story, so they use it as Siri. Okay. And then Avani ge adna he ge bala salu gottira lella. Avani ge for and for him I guess he had everything. No. Um. He had everyone. Oof. So, so he, Avani gave. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 So Avar in Tamil, so Avar. Uh, like he didn't have any worry. No. Yeah. He. Mm-hmm. Adna. That. Yeah. That ends. Okay. Yeah. Hege. Hege. I don't know. Hege. So. Oh. It's a question form. But hey. it's a question form, but used in a sentence. Hey, like, it just means yeah, like question. Ha- yeah, even ah, if you are okay. asking a person, hey, Gadira. Hmm. So that's the hey. Like, did you do that, hey, Gadira? So no, no, okay. Whenever, mm. I, whenever we talk, so we greet. Hmm. So asking, hi, hey, Gadira. Hmm. How are you? Yeah. Gotu. Gotu. Does it mean a pair? No. A so whenever somebody asks me something, I say, "Ha, nangi gotta do," or "Nangi illa nangi gotti illa." Okay. So like, "Illa <laughs> nangi gotti illa." Illa nangi. So, like in a normal sentence, so I will say, "Illa, illa mm-hmm. is no." Mm-hmm. Nangi. No, I'm fine. No. Nangi gotti illa. Is it no? I'm I'm good. No. Uh, Okay. No, I'm let's struggling. Let's do the second one. Okay. Let's let's leave the gotiralilla. Okay, sure. Bala salu gotiralilla. I don't know those two words. Okay. Okay. So, adarinda janarige tumba kasta vagutittu. Kasta means hard. Yes. Okay. Then I know. Yeah. Uh, what's the first word? Adarinda. Adarinda is an uh, other that I guess without that no. Other, you know, that, like, if he had that. No. Hmm. Uh, can you break the word? Uh, other in the. Other in the. Is is that one word? Is it yeah, two like words? Yeah, like in the. Means this. Yeah. Okay. Other. Other. Mm. Adu. So other we say so, adu. So, so adu that. Other in the. So adu means that, yeah. and then in in the means this. So that this, like this and that. No, in the is not. Actually, this. Okay. So, huh. adu darinda, like, yeah, adu darinda. Yeah, okay, because of that. Okay, you see, we would say adanal for that, huh. and so then you had a word like that earlier. Adu darinda because of that, like the adu ah. adu darinda is because of that. Okay, so then what does okay then what does adanal mean again? Adu darinda basically. Okay, okay. So it is like a, mm. yeah, there's no it's, it's there's no much meaning. longer. Yeah, 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 yeah. So because of that, so yeah. adu darinda. Adu darinda. And then okay, adu na. Janari ge. Ja janam so the people. Yeah. Okay. Tumba. Janari ge. Janari ge means for the people. Hmm. Uh, lots of tumba. Kasta vagutittu. Oh, because of that, lots of hardships for the citizens. Yeah, sim- similar, pretty close. Okay. Like okay, you have a lot of money, so you you do it for your good or the bad. So there is a word when I say do, in terms of the money or the wealth. So it's not give donations, nothing no. like that. Um, is to share his wealth. 
utilize oh he didn't know how to use as well or utilize oh, okay. as well and what's the word for use hege balasalu oh like yeah, hege yeah, is yeah. how balasalu is utilize ah but okay no that's yeah. totally different that's not the same yeah okay we'll say papayan padtu Uh, for use yeah balasalu oh payan padtu balasalu okay yeah. so basically in this in this town or whatever there is there there is a king and he didn't know how to use his wealth and then Other because of that ke. yeah so the janam were tumba kashta vagutte to okay lots of i got it lots of kashta yeah so the next is mantri gala sahaya dinda Okay, mantri is minister. Hmm. Yes. Sahaya. So mantri gal man- ministers. Sahaya. All of them. Sahaya. Oh, sahaya. Doesn't mean all. Saha. No. Um mantri gal sahaya. sahaya no, read, read the sentence. Okay, hmm. mantri gal sahaya dinda raja a siriyannu sereyagi balasi praje gala kashta dura maadida. Dura means far. Okay. like dura okay like dura is far yeah. also or oh, basically he send it away yeah. sort of yeah, yeah. uh asriyan means male teacher asiri oh okay asiri oh so asriyan okay asiri a uh, like that ah. siri siriyanu siri like siri is the wealth right yeah. so that wealth like yeah. asiri okay sereyagi balasi sereyagi does it mean destroy or Seri- spread seriyagi he correct sir yes sari means correct yes. aha yeah okay that's the same yeah sariyagi balasi balasi means uh, uses it yeah. now so praje gala uh, praje praje i don't know what praje. what does the kingdom have citizens yeah okay oh, okay okay yes yeah. praje praje gala kashta citizens like hardship like kashta dura maadida oh okay so you sort of brought all the hardships far away yes he removed it okay so what what did you say in the last sentence the the ministers so, helped the king yeah with the help of the ministers with the help of yeah, the like ministers yeah like mantri gala sahaya dinda raja a siriyannu sereyagi balasi prajegala kashta dura maadida i see so the whole thing means there was a king he had lot of wealth in his palace and he didn't know how to utilize it because of that the 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 people were facing lot of troubles with the help of his ministers he utilized his wealth properly and then kashtagala dura maadida so yeah okay yeah yeah okay, he yeah. yeah he helped the people so kashtade dura maagakida so sahaya means help help ah uh, okay so for us uh, help is udavi okay so we would say So you said mantri gal mantri galin like Sahayana. yeah so we I would say mantri galin uh, udavi udavi udan okay. so with okay with the with help, the help uh-huh. with the help of the ministers um selvate uh, um, yeah so selvate um selvate yeah the the huh, city. city yeah selvate city oof it's a little hard sense to translate <laughs> uh so kashtangale dooramaga akinar so he brought the custom yeah, far, away. far away yeah uh, okay yeah <laughs> that was uh that was so much struggle <laughs> <laughs> and and understandably so i mean i the the fact is the the languages are you know they share a lot in common but they're also quite different in many ways so a lot of similarities is what we think but when we're actually talking and then that's how we understand that you know what there are a couple of similarities but also they are like actually very unique in their own way exactly exactly yeah yeah they're, they they are as you said unique in their own ways but uh there's definitely a lot in common and that's why i thought it was it was nice to kind of ease into it in the beginning using uh you know quite a few words that are common and share the yeah. same root you know they're not words that came from other languages from like outside family language families right so uh that was interesting so you can see yeah okay there are a lot of common words there are you know words that you share but then once you get into longer sentences and and paragraphs and conversations then you realize okay there's there's definitely a, a major difference right i was going to say that maybe if i had an exposure because in malaysia you only have people speaking tamil 
so I've never been exposed to other South Indian languages. So maybe you would have yeah. had an easier time. Yes. I had no exposure. <laughs> What's yeah. so? And and that's that's true. And that's what makes this video more interesting, right? Because as somebody who has grown up in India and has been exposed to you know three, four different languages, South Indian languages, might be like, well, okay, I can. I don't speak them, but I can definitely understand quite a, quite a lot of it, right? So, so this way, this was a, this was a more interesting.